Next question is from Carnivore Girl 84 What are the pros and cons of wearing gloves when lifting? I'm a musician, and it's important for me to maintain flexibility in my hands and fingers. Yeah, so let's start with the obvious, right? Do you, you guys remember the um, the meme that was that went viral, like, I don't know, like probably four or five years ago, and it, it was like a glove, but it looked like underwear? Oh. Uh, it looked look like a, don't you guys remember that one? No. Pull it up, Doug, uh. look up. Uh, Glove meme underwear, and okay. you guys will see. I know you had to have seen this. Clip. No, I don't, what, oh, what, what yeah, did the I meme know say? I, have. It didn't, I don't think it said anything. It was just, a, or I think it said something like, "What you look like wearing gloves at the uh, gym." Uh, 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 you know what I'm saying? And it okay. looks like underwear. Like so, you'll well, see. Mark the, Wahlberg pulls it off. So, well, he wears There's, like gardening gloves. I mean, yeah, the white yeah, receiver yeah. gloves or whatever. You yeah. know? Okay, so let's talk about the obvious. You wear gloves, you're less likely to get calluses. Your skin is going to stay softer. So some people think you know that's important for them. So that's the obvious. But let's talk about the not so obvious. So I, as a kid, used to be a glove wearer when I worked out. And I wore, oh, there it is, hander pants. <laughs> That's great. It does look like that. That's hilarious. Hander pants. So when I was a kid, I wore the gloves that were the mesh like top yeah. and the fingers cut and off. The fingers cut off. And yeah. that was because of Rocky. I'm going to be honest, right? I watched Rocky. <laughs> I think we all went through a phase of that. Yeah. Well, just, they were they were popular back they then. They were. Yeah, and yeah. you know, Rocky, you know, he's in the first one. He's body bu Bodybuilders were rocking them back then, too. Yeah. Until and, you realize how bad they stink. Yes. And like, get rid of them. But here's the thing. I, I hate wearing gloves now because the, the I'm more connected to the bar and to the weights when I don't have gloves on because there's a lot of nerve endings in your hands and you oh, want to yeah. feel what's going on. And I feel like I can... I have better technique and form and connection mm -hmm. to the weight with my hands uh, without gloves than when I have gloves on. Here's something else that's less uh, that's not discussed often. When you wear gloves, you actually increase the circumference of the bar when you grip. So that may mean that it's harder for you to hold on to a bar. So it would be it's it's similar to grabbing a thicker barbell, right? So if you grab a thicker barbell, it's harder to hold on to a heavy weight when your hand is like this versus when your hand is. Oh, more I closed. would challenge that though. I would challenge that because I would say the the difference of that circumference uh, making it more difficult is negated by the a little bit better grip because you're using leather. I think you get just as good of a grip. I, not I don't. Better. I don't think. I don't, no. I no. Well, okay. Uh, let's compare it with chalk. Sorry, I always use chalk. So chalk versus gloves, oh, I get okay. just as well, good yeah. a grip. Yeah. Okay. That's but well, yeah. Well, chalk's no, the move. I'm, I'm mean, talking about barehanded. Barehanded versus yeah, gloves. With sweat, I get it. You get you get a better grip with gloves for sure. But it you know. So I think what you're saying is kind of negated by that. It's not. I think that's splitting hairs. The difference yeah. on it. it. But I'm curious what you guys think on her. So she specifically is a musician, and she's concerned about flexibility in her hands and fingers. Yeah, I don't know. I don't think it makes a difference with flexibility. Yeah. I could see it affecting your skin. I mean, I definitely have calluses from Right, that's what the only thing I would I would maybe consider wearing gloves if your fingertips and and stuff and your fingers get calluses well, on it and then that affects flexibility without the gloves, I would think. You would yeah. what? You'd have more flexibility without the gloves. Also, You'd have the, more range of motion, more connectivity. Yeah, yeah, but again, I think that's also splitting hairs too. I think also, you're not going to lose much by wearing gloves either. I'll ask you this que okay. this question, Justin, because you're the you're the musician of the group. Um, depending on the instrument that you that you play, uh, don't, aren't cal aren't don't you develop calluses from playing like the guitar? Sure. Oh, big time. Yeah. Yeah. So like, I, th I think it might be a detriment. And it's to advantageous having... too, right? Because otherwise, like it, there's always like a, a period you go through where um, you're, you're playing for a while and then it just like, it digs into your skin. And like, sometimes I've, I've gotten to the point too, where I've even cut, um, you know, the tips of my fingers and then it would set me back, uh, mm -hmm. you know, for a while. Um, but yeah, like it, just like anything else, I think um, you know your skin adapts uh, to to what stimulates. You ever seen provide. like a, a violinist neck? You ever seen that? They get like this thick patch of oh, cause they're skin because they're you know constantly the whole... like pinching that. Yeah, yeah, dude. Oh, interesting. Yeah, they get. I don't. There's actually actually a name for it. So I mean, I guess if if the calluses that you get from weightlifting affect your playing whatever instrument you're negatively. playing, negatively, then yeah, negatively, then you absolutely should wear gloves, and I think that's a smart strategy. Mm -hmm. If it doesn't affect you playing your instrument, then yeah. I think it's more beneficial to not wear gloves. Yeah. Now, right? I, I, or, I'm going I'm to argue this, right. like uh, chalk, if your gym doesn't allow chalk, uh, join another gym. Just kidding. If you can't use chalk in your gym, they have liquid chalk, which you can use. I feel way more connected to the weight when my skin is touching the barbell and the mm -hmm. dumbbells versus wearing gloves. I've tried gloves recently and I just don't feel as in control of the weight and, and the muscles I'm trying to isolate or feel than when I'm fully connected. And I think it's similar for like any gear that you wear. Now, sometimes gear is necessary. 
Um, like you can't go barefoot if you have weak, if you have poor ankle mobility and your feet are weak. But if your feet are strong and you got great ankle mobility, like you're going to feel more connected barefoot than you will with shoes when you do exercises for your lower body. So I think it's similar uh, with gloves. And if you're just starting out and that and calluses don't matter to you, you're like, whatever, if I get calluses, I get calluses. I would argue do it without gloves because I feel like if you do something for a long time with gloves, it'll be hard to transition versus starting out without gloves and doing it the whole time that way. Hey, if you enjoyed that clip, you can find the full episode here or you can find other clips over here. And be sure to subscribe.